Good morning, IG and everybody watching, man. Facebook, all that shit. You know, I want to take the time to say, you know what? I'm human. I got out of my character yesterday. I definitely did. I let something get to me. I already know what it is. It just certain things I don't play about, you know what I'm saying? You know, the joke about one thing, that's another. You know, hey, man. But when you start, like, falsely accusing and making certain accusations about me, or just a man, period, that ain't cool. And I want to take the time to say I apologize because, you know, my daughter happened to see my post and was like, Dad, why you talking like that? And I'm like, yo, it took my daughter to say something like that to make me snap out of it. I apologize to any, you know, anybody who may have said, Jockey better than that and I may have let you down. But I am human, and I, I want to say I apologize, and I'm in a better space, and I know better. So with that being said, I love you. Well, there you go. Looks like your man, Young Jock, is more of a man than I am, my lord, because I would have never apologized. But then again, I would have never called my girl Carly Redbone a thought or anything else negative in the first place because Carly Redbone is too damn fine and too damn light-skinned for me to be dissing. But anyways, my lord, shout out to Young Jock for apologizing for the things that he said about his beautiful ex-girlfriend Carly Redbone. If y'all don't know what happened, man, go look it up, man. I, I done made videos about what was said between the two of them. I, I'm not gonna repeat it because, A, it's over now, he apologized, and I say good work, Jock, but listen, you're a much better man than I am. But then again, you're a much bigger man than I am too, because all I got is a mean three and a half inches, and I wouldn't be able to reach the bottom of Carly Red like you were talking about before. I wouldn't have been able to reach the bottom at all. I can't reach the bottom of one of them little yogurt cups. But that's none of y'all business. Anyways, my lord, let me know what y'all think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine, Meat Magazine 7 of Google+, Meat Magazine blog on Instagram. Listen, I couldn't hit the walls of a thimble, to tell you the truth. I couldn't hit the walls of a medicine cap. Hell, I can't even fill the walls of a toothpaste cap. But that's none of y'all business. Meat Magazine. I know, I know, I know, haters, TMI, too many inches.